So you two nasty saw what I brought? Yeah. yeah. It's, a, it's a diesel. It's a diesel. Hell yeah, it's a diesel. Cool. What year is it? It's an 01. It's pretty nice. 73? Hell yeah, it's a 73. Cool. It got it got a little bit, just a you know, a little bit of work that it needs. It's a you know a little bit of dented bumper and you know it has a little bit of rust. You know, I'm not gonna lie, you know, I saw it and I said, you know, it has a little bit of rust and not too eh, it's just a little bit that should have buff out oh it'll buff, yeah, it'll buff out what about that one over there yeah. that one buff out oh, good. Don't worry. Worry. you fit through that hole we got it we got it all right so you know it's a it's a project what do you oh, do that again L look at the bed the bed look at the bed how it goes down oh. it's probably being held by by that old bed liner that it had so it'll buff out don't worry about it okay. it'll be fine yeah, yeah. all right so can you guys work with this one? Definitely yeah. work with this one. This one, what we're gonna do. Well, the first thing is that we're gonna that, that, that rusted ass bed. Well, I found it, when I was out there, I found that bed also. So I just yeah, went so ahead we're and. We're gonna replace that one. And this one too, the fender, it's pretty, pretty messed it's up. Pretty already. messed up. We're not even gonna bother to fix it since it's already all turned off from the bottom. So we're just gonna get a new one for it and put it on here and just get a new bumper. The grill seems uh, looks really good. The lights, we're gonna change them. What we're pretty much gonna do with this truck is we're just gonna black it out like your 7.3, what you did to it. So you guys are gonna follow the tradition of the 7.3 and you guys are gonna make that one. Yeah. Gonna black Tell it you out what, completely. we actually have a lot of parts for this one. Really? Yeah, we, I mean, I have a brand new set of injectors there and I think that they're, um, they're stage 1.5 injectors, so. You know, let, let's check out the motor. Let's see how, how it looks. Actually, I turned it on and I drove it. Um, it was, you know, I did about 55, 60 and it, it was fine. Um, I thought it was gonna fall apart, but it actually held together with the rust, so. Yeah, that, yeah, that's the thing. I couldn't open it, that's why. I think you have to like press it and Let's get a screwdriver, hold on. Yeah. All right, we got it. What the fuck? Guys, the motor doesn't look bad. It does not look bad. It's pretty clean. It actually is pretty yeah. clean. Yeah. I was expecting a freaking mess all over the place. Well, it has some oil. I mean, it's a, it's a freaking 20 year old truck, yeah. but you know, normal, but I was actually expecting like the 7.3, like, yeah. the, like the other one. The other one was freaking. Can work with it yeah and, and it sounds and it sounds fine um i put the i took the scanner with me and i put the scanner on it it only had one code mm -hmm. um so we'll, we'll go ahead and fix that one and the other codes that came out were all like the the sensors for the bumper and the airbags and which is understandable but that's why i kind of felt good at it um you know draw fine it sounds fine turns on right away um so i think that we can work with this one right. definitely work with this one all right, guys. All right, very excited. You guys aren't going to say that crap that you said? You know, because there's people always hounding me. Oh, what happened to the girls? And where did they go? And where are the girls? And we kind of got sick. Yeah. Yeah. yeah how's Pretty COVID? Uh, we, beat it's over. It. we beat it. Oh, we really? COVID. Yeah, we yeah. beat it. it probably, actually, COVID died because they it went inside no, you. Right? No, no. no. Yeah. Okay. Uh, this is the first thing that we're going to start, guys, uh, as you can see. There's a factory uh, primer, so that's really good for us. Uh, we don't have to do that much. All, we, all we're gonna do right now is gonna power wash it. All this nasty dirt, look at this, all everywhere. There's bottles and everything in there. So that's what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna clean it and just let it dry, so let's get to it.
Okay guys, so we're pretty much done uh, washing the whole thing. Uh, what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna take these plastics off and this little bar right here so we could like start messing with this. So let me get to it. All right guys, so what we're doing right now is we're pretty much just cleaning the bottom of the bed uh, to get it clean because we want to. Uh, we have some paint there. It's a uh, heavy duty frame paint. And as you can see, it has a factory uh, primer. So there's not nothing really much to it. We just got to make sure it's clean so we can uh, just throw on the paint on there. So right now we're just pretty much cleaning what's left of the dirt. And after that, we're going to get to the spring. Okay, so All right guys, so we already put the frame paint in here. Uh, what we're gonna do right now is we're gonna give it a layer of uh, the frame paint. Uh, you really need to mix it with anything guys, not even reducer, just pour it in there and start shooting. So that's what we're gonna start doing. So let's get to it. Oh, by the way, we already cleaned it with uh, paint, uh, paint, uh, paint thinner, sorry. Uh, so it's already, already prepped, so let's start spraying. Alright guys, so I'm pretty much done for the first coat. Uh, like like I said guys, uh, it doesn't really matter. It doesn't affect how we're gonna fix the truck. It's just so the undercarriage can look black. So that's pretty much it, that's the first coat. Uh, I'm gonna let it sit there for 10 minutes and then come back and give it a second coat. So let's get to it. I'm gonna go clean this. Okay guys, so we're back. Uh, we let it sit there for about 15 minutes. So it's pretty much ready for the second pass. Uh, so let's get to it. Okay guys, so that's pretty much the second coat. Uh, we covered the whole thing. That should be it for tonight. Uh, like always guys, uh, this is the, this is it. So just stay tuned and just like and subscribe guys. Like and subscribe, thanks.